hockey fan says Jack is no longer allowed to play in the CHL. since you've been back and I know that you miss playing hockey and skateboarding and all that fun stuff but um I got a surprise that I think might cheer you up Here they are. I forgot that I gave them to Louie. He likes to keep track of these things. <laughs> oh, right there. Oh. When it's nachos. <laughs> Darn! Louie, just wait. Um, okay, guys, uh, why don't you go ahead? Now, one, two, three. Give these to the ticket agent. And I'm so sorry I couldn't get his seats all together, but we'll see you on the plane, okay? Scoot. See you on the plane, Jack. Louie, come on. Put that down. All right, now, children. Everybody, now listen up, everybody. We've got a plane to catch. To settle. We've got to hurry, Louie. Now, please, please. Oh, for heaven's sake. Oh, God. Oh, Miss Alexandra, can I please go to the washroom, please? Oh, my shattered nerves. <laughs> Sit right away. We're about to taxi out of the gate. No, 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 no. I, I really need to check on the other chimp passengers. They're with me. They, they, they're fine. They're, they're fine. Gracias. Gracias. Oh, hi, guys. Oh, I'll talk to you later. I've given your boarding passes to the nice ticket agent here. Oh, I'm going to Flight TA673, Denver, Colorado.
here's your juice. I like your class juice. Would you like some juice? I have cranberry and... Did I see you? Oh, man, you look great. You having fun? Sort of. It'd be better if I had someone to ride with. Well, that's why I wanted you to join the club, man. Oh. Look, I, I know you're sad because you miss your friends, but you're going to make new friends here. And you have great memories of home, and we can always go there and visit. Not next week. No, not next week. And I'm so sorry work is taking me away before we're even settled, but Jay's going to take great care of you. I'll bet that before I even get back, you're going to love this place. I love you, Petey. Oh, 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 Louie. Louie, I just had the most terrifying dream. I dreamed that we left Jack behind at the airport. I, I, I think I'm just going to go check on the others. Where's Jack? Thanks. OK, boys, remember, all my numbers are on the fridge. You better move on, Pop, so you miss your plan, and then Petey and I will have to cancel the epic fiesta we got planned. Oh, no worries. Just a couple hundred of our closest amigos. Right, bro? He's joking, Dad. I barely know anyone yet, remember? Yeah, Pete. Kid is the key word, huh? Pete, you can call me anytime you want, all right? And we'll settle you in as soon as I get back. I'm sorry I have to go, pal. I love you. Remember, you're the responsible one. All right. Be safe. Be smart. Bye, Edward. <laughs> Bye, boys. Oh, uh, What's that, bro? I didn't say anything. What's that? Oh, Mexican food again? All right, then, if you insist.
No flights returning to Essemian or anywhere for that matter. There's a hurricane coming in. A hurricane? The airport is closed? We don't know when the airport will be open again. Oh, no. Sharon, but while you're here at Jalapenos, you can call me Juanita. I'm gonna cut to the chase because me and my brother here are about as hungry as we are, Foxy. I'll have four chicken burritos, two chicken chimichangas, a chocolate milkshake. Oh, and can you stick some of those gnarly churros in my shake, Pete? Uh, a cheese quesadilla, please. I hope you enjoy your meal at Jalapenos. A little bit of Mexico, right here in Colorado. Ole. Juanita, and don't forget, extra guacamole. Sir Pete, we are going to have the most stellar times here. It's kind of hard to have fun when you don't have any friends. You're going to have so many buds, you're going to have to hire me as your social convener. Yeah, I guess. You know, the hill here is so rad. That alone is worth the move. Plus, a band I found to join here is going to make me a rock star! <laughs> we already have a gift plan for next weekend, so prepare to feast your eyes on guitar greatness. Most unusual flavor in this burrito, I must say. <laughs> hmm. Juju bees, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> oh. Hurry up! I need more dessert and pronto.
Nate's done the art of meditation, scat, bro. Make like a stocking and run. You don't want to be late for your first day of school. <laughs> Bye, Jay. You chumps ruined the heist that could have made us very rich men. I mean, all you had to do was sit in a car and wait. Was that too much to ask of you or what, huh? Now you guys owe me, and you owe me big. May I suggest that you find me my money quickly, or else it's gonna get ugly. Gabish. <laughs> now get out and get me my money! Gilfred, you idiot, this is all your fault. I'm not an idiot, you're an idiot. Now what do we do, huh? Did you think of that before you lost all Polly's money? Huh? Who goes to get a burger when they're the getaway driver? All you had to do was sit in the car! I was in the car, it was a drive through. <laughs> You know that jump we built off the back of the train park? I stopped to make fly after that yesterday. Technically, that isn't possible, Chaz. Oh, yeah? Well, I did melon grab off it. Yeah, right. He did. I saw him. It's a treat to meet you, Pete. I'm Helena. I'm Jay. Hey. <laughs> I got band practice tonight. Can you buzz it home? Yeah, sure. You're in a band? Yeah, got our first gig coming up. Cool. Well, later, Pete. Where are you from? Uh, Oregon. All right, you guys. You guys can go ahead. much snowboarding before? Yeah, I used to race up a summit just outside of Portland. Impressed. You know, I'll bet you love the snow here. It's really light, some of the best snow around. for Summit in Oregon. Never heard of it. It's one of the most extreme mountains on the West Coast. Big hill.
god! There you are! <laughs> we were just gonna come and find you. Yeah. I think I lost you guys in those trees over there. I just want to fall off a cliff. Oh, darn. They call that the doom drop. Just remember, when in doubt, always take a right. I'm sorry, dude. It's okay. But can you imagine taking that drop? I mean, the air you would get? Yeah, that'd be cool. Hey, you're a good snowboarder. <laughs> Not today. Aw, oh, you just need to get used to the slopes. Come on, you'll be shredding like normal in no time. Yeah, maybe. Hey, they're all down at the lodge having hot chocolate. You should go. No, I better head home. Will we see you tomorrow? Yeah, okay. See ya. Later, Pete. You should go home, little guy. Jack, is that your name? <laughs> I guess you could come with me. Come on. What are you gonna wear? No, 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 wear the one with the green. That would look way hotter, trust me. No, no, trust me. Oh my god, Marsha, you should just see these guys in my store. You remember Tommy's cheesy older brother, Leanne? Just like that. It's ridiculous. You stay here. I'll get us something to eat. should do this. It doesn't feel right. She's onto us, Stanley. We shouldn't rob this store. Well, no wonder she's looking at us. What kind of guy reads a decorating magazine? Hey, look. Do you see what I see? It's the same. He's the... Here you go. You thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> ah, you can teach us how to skateboard. No, you idiot. 
That chimp's gotta be worth the big bucks. If we get him, we can pay back Polly right away. Yeah, he yeah. teach us how to skateboard. Uh. Oh my god, Kate, just a second, hit. Not so fast. You guys didn't pay for those. Empty your pockets. Kill Frank. Well, you see my friend and... Where'd they go? Monkeys are fast, Gilfred. Hey, wasn't that kid holding a snowboard? And? So let's check out the ski hill, you turkey. Come on, Jack. It's just my brother and his band practicing. You stay here for one sec. All right, dude, that was good. Let's go again and try to keep up this time, Carl. One, two, three, four. That man, you got a Mexican champ in your house, dude. Leonis, I'm at a loss for words. Yo, it's your house, man. Come on, where did you get the Mexican monkey from? It's not mine. Whoa. Jack. I think he's lost. Whoa. I'll make you famous. Knuckle dragger. <laughs> How'd board club go? I stunk. I don't know what was wrong with me. Everyone thinks I'm a total loser. Look to your kin, bro. You being a loser is genetically impossible. Now you being the raddest, coolest 12-year-old in town, much more likely. Huh. Dude, over here! Give it up! I brought in my wheelie caught from the garage. But that caught! Dude! Jack's a chimp. He's probably used to sleeping on sticks and moss and stuff. <laughs> this cod's probably going to be like a waterbed to him. <laughs> Maybe he can sleep in Dad's room. Dude, Dad won't even let me sleep in his bed, let alone a little monkey. Okay, okay, bad idea. We start working on getting Jack home tomorrow.
Chuck, buddy. Hey, you hungry, pal? What'll it be? We have your top of the line sugar flakes, guaranteed to spiral you into sugar induced hyper fits. We got all the bran and fiber you ever need in the stuff my dad eats to stay regular. Oh, I don't choose this, it's harsh sickening. We have orangutangos. Alrighty then, orangutangos it is. So how'd you sleep last night? My cock's pretty sweet, huh? It's the Deluxe Ultra Super Individually Pocketed Coil Pro Camper Cot, you know? There you are. Morning, little bro. Chuck him out. He's got better table manners than you, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> so you look into it? Yeah, we'll get him home. Remember, he needs our help. Yep, I'm gonna make some calls today. Speak to the Mexican consulate, Taco Bell. I'll figure it out, bro, no worries. We'll get Jack back to the land of the almighty burrito. Bye, Jack. Have a good day. Mm. Oh, we'll pick you up for boarding after school. Yeah, cool. Thanks. It's gonna let up soon, Louie, and then we can get out of here. But it's too windy to go swimming. side 180. And Pete, you got some sweet air off that last jump. Yeah, it was okay. Except he was uh, rolling down windows the whole time. <laughs> well, Pete, hopefully you can keep landing it for the partner board across. What? It's the big race, man. Free passes if we win, right? Yep, and new boards. And the winner gets to shred with Bjorn Linus for a whole day. Really? But who's he gonna ride with? We're all partnered up. We'll think of something. Go get a complex, come on. Let's jam already. Oh. Jack, dude, Pete be home soon. Make yourself at home. Come on, be good. <laughs>
sweet. That was a stellar moment in music history you just chopped up. Where's Jack? In the living room. No, he's not. Yes, he is. No, he's not. He's there, bro. I was just there. Dude, stay right where we are. I'll be right back. Oh, dude, you need glasses. Good morning, Jack. Stanley, you're there. Uh, I'm Stanley. I don't see what the point is. I mean, everyone's just getting ready for the race. Yeah, and you're the best little shredder on this year mountain, so you better be getting ready for the race, too. But you need a partner to enter it, and I don't have one. Pete, we'll find you a partner. You just gotta give a little bit of time. Huh. Jack, buddy, I'm afraid you're on your own for a few. I'm heading to the chalet to munch on some sandwiches. No chimps allowed, but I'll grab you one, huh? <laughs> Later, bro.
you guys. Let's try another one. Okay, who's first? What the? Huh? Oh, no! What was that? Jack, are you okay? <laughs> Pete, he's a monkey. Phil, I think he's figured that out. Is he yours? Well, sure he is. See the similarities? <laughs> <laughs> we found him. I think he's from Mexico. Hey, Pete, you gonna teach him how to ride? It looks like he wants to learn. Come on, Jack, try again. Come on, Jack, you can do it one more time. I've got the keys to the car. I'm going out on an afternoon vacation. They all know where I'm gonna go. <laughs> You want to race? Chaz and Graham are so good. Are you sure we can do this? No rain. The hurricane is over. We can get out of here. Hi. Um. Could you tell me when the next available flight to El Simeon is, please? Oh, Louie. We can go find Jack. Go for it. Pretty good, but stop it next time. Go over here. Hello? 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 I have the wrong... I'm sorry, I have the wrong... I don't care what you say. Macaroni and cheese? is definitely more nutritious than ravioli. It's got cheese, otherwise known as calcium. J is powdered cheese. All the calcium and powdered cheese to put hair in your chest, boy. Huh? Hello? Pete, is that you? Yeah, hey, Dad. Hey, that that's that's really odd. I, I, I just caught you there. You 
do. It's just G and I, me and Jay are just us two. What in the world is that? It's, uh, it's nothing. You know Jay, he's watching TV. Oh. Oh. Is everything all right there? Uh, yeah, things are totally good, Dad. Well, I just called to say that work's going great. <laughs> Gotta go there, bye. <laughs> Dang. Bye. It's weird. Maybe this isn't the right place. I haven't seen a chimp anywhere. Patience, Stanley. There's only one hill, and that kid was walking with a ski board. Snowboard. Snowboard. Whatever. Thank you. Please pay over there at the window. Perfect. Hello, thank you for calling Little India Curry Up. How may I direct your call? Bing bong, bing bong. Shut up. Stanley, give it a rest. Where's my money? Uh, no, very sorry. No, Mr. Stanley, here I am, Rahim. Our curry special today is fried duck. Look, you stroons. I'll fry your duck. You got one week to come up with my money, Kabish. Thank you for calling the House of International Curry Pancakes. Goodbye. down there. I almost went off this. Come on, we have to climb back up from here. Jack. Come on, let's go down to the other lift. The line won't be as long. Let's go. <laughs>
on the next flight back home to track down Jack. Who wants to come help me? <laughs> you know, on second thought, why don't you guys just stay here and enjoy yourselves? I mean, after all, everything is already paid for. <laughs> and that way, I can bring Jack back as quickly as I can. <laughs> all right, Louie, you can come. All right, Jay. That's enough. Get up. Come on. How many times have I... Jay, how many... See him at Jack. He's been really good company around here this week. Kept us out of trouble. Yeah, and, and he's really clean. Uh, cleaner than a dog, or, or even Jay. Way cleaner than Jay. Um, yeah, we're pretty sure he came from Mexico. We've been trying to track his family down. No luck so far, so I use my magical charm to get this female news reporter to do a story. Very industrious, Jay. He didn't leave me his man of the house for no reason. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll be in El Simeon soon, and hopefully someone there will know where Jack went. Sure hope so. Hey, Katie, you made it. Hey, a snowboarding chimp? How could I miss it? So anyway, you're going to talk about the search for Jack's family, right? Right. We want to do a whole thing. We'll show the snowboarding, of course. Plus, we want to do the big missing primate report, try to track down his family. Come on, they're over there at the half pipe. <laughs> Don't worry. They only want to take a couple pictures of you for TV. So maybe your family will see you. Sorry, but I can't give you any information about any passenger, past or present that's airline policy. But Jack is lost and we won't find him. So Will you stop sorry, that, Louis? Next. But we really need your help, please. <laughs> Next, please. Louis. Louis? <laughs> <laughs> 
All right, all right, maybe just this once. Oh. Let the gentleman do his job, Lily. Oh, not that one. Maybe this is him here. Uh, January the 11th, uh, flight 673 to Denver, Colorado. Oh. A boy missed his flight, but someone still took his seat. That's it. We will take two tickets to Colorado immediately, please. Are you going to be checking this, or is it carry-on? Spectators at the Blackbrush Mountain Half Pipe were treated to quite a sight today. Let's go now to Mount Blackbrush to check out the action. This is Katie Parson reporting to you live from Mount Blackbrush with the amazing story of Jack the Snowboarding Chimp. Jay and his brother Pete found Jack, and they're currently desperately trying to locate Jack's missing family. And we think he's from Mexico because he had this huge sombrero when we found him. So if anyone out there has any idea where Jack's family might be, please call the station. This is Katie Parsons saying goodbye from Mount Blackbrush. <laughs> Are you ready, Gilfred? I don't understand why I have to work, Brad. Oh, that must be Dad. He forgot his keys again. Bro, it's definitely not Dad. Whoa! Can I help you guys with something? Yes, hello, senor. Senor? My name is Mr. Saratunasa, and, and we have come here, my wife and I, as the legal guardians of Jack, to take him home. Oh. Uh, it is my understanding that you have found him. We, we saw the news report. Uh, yay, bless, bless. <laughs> we we'll come to take Jack home to back to me. Government of Mexico? Well, this does look official. We thought he was Mexican. Oh, he, he is. His home is in Mexico. Just outside of Mexico. Hit it. We so appreciate that you took such good care of him, although we don't know how to repay you. Jack, these people have come to take you home. Oh. <gasps> it's okay, Jack. They're gonna take you back to Mexico. Uh -huh. Wacky uh -huh. Jack, it's time to go. Well, Jim Meister, looks like the time has come. I miss you, bud. Bye, Jack. with his family now. But he looks so sad to go. Well, that's probably because he knew how much he was going to miss you. We'll have even more than enough money to pay off Ollie once we sell this chimp. Ah! <laughs> oh. Uh. Oh. Uh. You idiot. Oh, 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 sir, I'm 
sir, 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 please, please wait. Um, this is, it's Jack. Uh, he's the chimp who got on the wrong plane last week, and we were told that he ended up here. Do you know anything about him? No. Uh, Isn't that him right there? This is another chimp. This is Louis. Listen, sorry, ma'am, but I'm late for my next arrival, so, um, uh, good luck, and, um, thanks for flying. Bye-bye. on the lighter side, spectators at the Blackbrush Mountain half pipe were treated to quite a sight. Now, usually you think of a chimpanzee swinging through the trees in the jungle and eating bananas. But WPKV's own Katie Parsons brings you the story of an amazing primate who likes to catch a different hey, kind of air. that's you on the TV! Let's go now to Blackbrush Mountain and check out the action. His name is Jack, Jack? and as you can see, he is an amazing snowboarder. Jack? But he is also missing his family. The family is believed to be Mexican. If anyone out there knows where Jack's family is, please call the station. This is Katie Parson signing off from Mount Blackbrush. I dropped a little dude off of the hill. Oh, how was he? Bummed out. Oh, I'll get it. Hello? Hey, Katie. Oh, no. Okay, Dad, calm down. Remain calm, Dad. Jay. Just take a chill pill. What is going on? The news station called and said Jack's real family is on their way to get Jack. Those other guys are imposters. Hey, Pete. Why aren't you dressed? He's gone. He went back to Mexico. Jack? But the race. He was your partner. Yeah, I just came here to cheer you guys on. Oh, man. I'll see you after the race. Have a good one. But Pete... Later. What was he so bummed about? He was only a monkey. And his racing partner. Bet you're really Chaz. Okay, guys, come on, let's go. We're gonna go warm up. <laughs> So what's this big surprise you keep talking about? Well, let's just say it's gonna make you very happy, boss. Yes, uh, very happy. Come on, hurry up. I ain't got all day here. Are you sure you're ready? Yeah, I'm sure. Absolutely. Just ready. open the door. <laughs> Ta-da! Now, boss, before you get mad, know this. That is a very famous chimp, and you could sell him for a lot of money. I know who this is, you idiots! What the heck are you two guys doing with Jack anyway, huh? You know Jack. Of course I know Jack, you morons! He's a snowboarding chip, all right? And for your information, he has a race this afternoon. And I got a thousand clams bet on him to win! Clams? You bet. Clams on a monkey? Dollars, okay? A thousand dollars, you bozos! You know what? Your chances are up! That's right, your time has run out. You're gonna work off this debt. Get this bunch of kids out of here! Huh? Oh. <laughs> Don't worry, okay? Everything's gonna be okay. Yeah, me and you, we're gonna be friends. <laughs> Hi, um, Mount, um, Blackbrush, please, where the, uh, the border cross is going on. I I'm coming, hon. Could you put this in the back, please? And the way that you ride that half pipe is, uh, rat. I mean, rat is the right word to use here, no? <laughs> and the air that you get on those jumps, spot on. It's amazing. Jack, cigar. Oh, what can I say? I got a soft spot for chimps. Hey, Mama Lou, can you step on it here or what? Jack's got a race to get to. Where, Jack? Tutto a posto. Che lo. Don't worry, Jay will find him, big guy.
Aries, you want to do it? We can do this, right? Oh, yeah, but you gotta hurry up and get changed. It's gonna start. Come on. All right, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Mount Black Rush in the beautiful state of Colorado for this year's Partner Border Cross Racing Spectacular. I'm Kayla Phillips here with pro snowboarder phenomenon, Jorn Leiden. Give it up for Jorn! Let's go, come on. We have some great young talent in this year's competition. I think we're in for a real treat today. It's so beautiful. Have you ever seen anything like this? Come on. Hey, you must be Julie. Uh, yeah. I'm Jay. It's nice to meet you. Oh, right. Uh, the, the TV station told us that we could meet you and Jack here, but, I, well, I guess he's getting ready for the race. Yes, he is. <laughs> but it was a close call, Julie. Well, what do you mean it was a close call? Well, it's a long story. <laughs> Anyway, thank you so much for taking such good care of him. I forgot. I'm so sorry. This is Louis, Jack's little brother. Louis, J, J, Louis. Anyway, come on. We have to get to the front row. Louis and I just can't wait to see them. Come on. Sure. Chad's a very accomplished boarder. I think his aggressive style perfectly suits this course here at Mount Black Rush. This is going to be an awesome race. The race is to start, Jack. Are you ready? Boarders to your marks. You can do this, right? Set. goes in a border cross.
Check it out. The doom drug, Jack, is too big. <laughs> You're crazy, Jack. Jack's mom? That I am. You must be Pete. I guess I have you to thank for taking such good care of Jack. It was kind of fun. So, Jack, you ready to go home now? Well, actually, I was thinking, if you guys could just stay for one more night, there's kind of this big event happening tonight, and it wouldn't be the same if Jack wasn't there. Sure. Hey, bud. They're calling for you and Jack up there. Good going, man. Yeah. That was an insane run! You're a madman! That was an awesome jump. Thanks, guys. And you too, Jack! And here they are, everybody! Let's give it up for Pete and Jack, our champions! <laughs> I've never seen anybody take it. You really deserve to win. Thanks, Jess. And now, the terrible twosome that took the doom drop like it was a baby jump. The biggest, baddest cliff in all of Mount Blackbrush. Pete and Jack, this year's Border Cross Champions. Give it up! And here's your first place prize, a brand new snowboard. All right. Pete, what say me and you go for a victory run, buddy? You and me? Yeah, let's go. Woo!
pretty tight, dog. Yeah. Good luck, Jay. But you guys will play great tonight. Thanks, little bro. Fat greasy burgers, I'm gonna have to put for the week and pay off Polly. Since you've been gone, the world has changed. What happened at Great Pain? I'll set a dot. I fail the same event when I'm far away. Are you being a son? Have you done anything at all? Do you feel alone? I wanna. That was absolutely neat. Cut. <laughs> neat. That was just neat. Whoa. For me? I guess. Amazing <laughs> chips. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you got you 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 Bubby's on the front porch, sitting alone, he's got nobody. Takes a drink from his water glass and cries to himself, he's so lonely. Does he really want to wait? He's got to find somebody before it gets too late. 